Step three vegetable oil specifically is once refined uh, degum soybean oil with a high quality emulsifier which allows the molecule of the chemical to be encapsulated uh, by the, the oil so we don't have again sunlight degradation, we don't have oxygen degradation and we get more chemical from the sprayer tip to the point of contact where the chemical needs to be. It doesn't do us any good to uh, spray the chemical on and have a 30% or 40% of it degenerated by oxygen or sunlight degradation. Decreasing input costs in our farms were achieved by reducing fertility, fertilizer, N, P, N, K, and also reducing the amount of herbicides that we've been using. On this farm, we've actually reduced anywhere from $80 to $100 an acre on some of these inputs. It's a lot of money that is put right towards the bottom line. Well, the bottom line is a huge thing for American agriculture right now. We need to be able to sustain the soil, the water, and the people. And to be able to do that, we need profit in agriculture. And that bottom line is the profit. And if we're not able to achieve that, agriculture is gonna take a step backwards and food costs are gonna go high and we will not be able to produce what we need. When we're using the step three vegetable oil, we're able to cut rates anywhere from 20 to 80%. And we're very happy with the results we're getting. We're seeing anywhere from 90 to 95% reduction of weeds. And that five, last 5%, five we're able to come in with a post if we need to clean them up. Sometimes we're getting up to 98%. And that's where we want to be. With reduced chemical usage, we've been able to cut rates anywhere from 50 to 90%. It has increased our profits. It's pretty interesting in the farming industry uh, in this area. Uh, everybody's always looking over the fence. And if this looks good over here, then we're gonna try that. If it looks good over there, we're gonna try that. I'm to the point now where I don't look over the fence no more. 